Well, good morning, everybody. Hope everyone's having a great day. I am a little, <laughs> I'm sick still. I don't like to complain about being sick, but uh, not a lot I can do about it right now. We're gonna go, I need to get some fresh air. So I'm gonna go sit by the pool. We got just a whole bunch of kids upstairs. All they wanna do all night. And I'm gonna complain because I'm, I'm sick and I'm tired. Because uh, all they wanna do is push a chair around the whole time. They only come to Aonang to go above my room <laughs> and push a chair around the whole time. So I'm not really sure why that's an exciting thing to do I guess so yeah I'm gonna sit by the pool for a moment over here by the bathroom maybe and we're still not really able to take a shower because there's no water I mean, you can, it just trickles out cold water. Mike and Nicole said they got good water, so that's good for them. Yeah, well, I'm glad. If I would have spent a lot of money for that, I'd want some water, too. But we're on the second floor. There's yeah. no pressure. So. Well, I'm going to do my best to get some food in here because I have no energy at all. Something not so, spicy. Maybe not. No spice, no hamburger. Joe went to go eat Burger King. Pizza yesterday, Burger King today. Good job, Joe. Can't wait to hit that scale on the way home. <laughs> I guarantee I probably lost five kilo last night. Yeah. Seven, The people upstairs just got back. I thought I would take a nap. I think I took about a good three hour nap where I got three hours of sleep because I hear them up there doing the chairs again. I, oh. <laughs> I told Paige, just go have fun. Go out there with them. You don't need to stay. Paige would stay here and take care of me. And she has the whole time. She didn't want to leave my side. So... <laughs> I'm very thankful for that, but I'm not a very good sick person. Like, I don't like this shit at all. <laughs> I don't like it. I rarely get food poisoning, rarely. I took two charcoal pills when I realized I was sick, but I think it hit me a little bit too late. And then, uh, yeah, I don't know, it was weird. But anyway, Paige, is, Paige and Gift are down there getting massage. They booked our room for tomorrow. We're headed back to Sarat Thani. We were going to just try to make it home, back home tomorrow, but I can't. I'd probably be okay, but I'm really, really weak right now. So I said, they wanted to know we could just stay another night here. I said, well, let's just go down the road about three hours. I'll be fine. And they picked out a really nice resort. So tomorrow's going to be fun, but... I told them all, I said, you guys could go on an excursion right down the street here. And we've done this before. You can go hire a, a private uh, long tail boat and go take some tours. You can go down to go see James Bond Island.
go island hopping, snorkeling, a lot of stuff to do here. Very cool place. And now everything is pretty much open. It's not super overly crowded as I thought it was going to be. I'm pretty sure Phuket and PP Island are going to be, especially PP because it's not super big. Anyway, guys, sorry, a lame day today. I did want to make a video though because <laughs> it's kind of hard to sh to <laughs> to hide the fact that I got food poison, but. I don't like to talk bad about other businesses it's because stuff happens, you know. I don't think that they intentionally have bad food or whatever the case. And who knows? Who knows what happened? So nobody got sick but me. So I don't, I don't really know what happened. Bye. Hmm? Will you be my favorite? Why? Well, I would like to have two grilled cheese sandwiches. Grilled cheese sandwich? 7 Eleven? Yeah. Okay. How much you miss it? It's been. You can do a boat tour. Huh? If you get on the boat. No. Just my side. I just walk. Walk to the end on the left and then come back. Keep going. Mm -hmm. What are you doing? Do my side. Alright. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, don't get your brushy. You want yeah. anything? Mm -mm. Why not? Yeah. <laughs> Why not? What do you want me to do? Nothing, I think he can do it. Alright. Thank you. I feel better after the sandwiches. Thank you. Hmm? I feel better after the sandwiches. Thank you. Okay. I guess I'm gonna have to take a cold shower, huh? Mm-hmm. Didn't make Is there any water in the shower? Uh huh. My water, but not very strong. We still don't have water. So I'm, I'm glad I don't. I'm glad we had some water. Having food poisoning, that was uh, would have been interesting. We wouldn't be able to. I don't know what the hell I would have done. Um, but it just trickles down cold water. That's what you need when you're sick, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Some cold water when you're not feeling well, that'll, do you, uh, that'll fix you right up. Uh, uh, I need to come outside. We're leaving in the morning. Huh? We're leaving in the morning. Yeah.
Well, the internet's not good here to try to upload a video. There's no water, no hot water. The people upstairs are crazy loud. And um, I have to go to the bathroom every like two minutes. But I'm okay now. I, I think I'm getting better like I haven't gone in a little while. Um, but yeah, I would say this particular resort probably needs some... Uh, you know, here's the thing about, I think, Thailand right now, and probably a lot of places. I still believe that they lost a lot of their qualified people during the COVID, you know, so it's gonna be difficult for them to get back on track where they were. I think all of those good, hardworking, qualified people have left, and uh, it's gonna be difficult for them to try to get it back. A lot of times in the hotels, they're not Thai people, they come from neighboring countries too so yeah it is what it is i'm just explaining to you guys when you come make sure your expectations are a little low the hotel can't help the water deal i know that I, the people down next to us have really high pressure water and it's hot and i was thinking maybe they just don't have the pump on right here because there's no water she's like no everybody's the same I'm like well, you don't really know, so why even ask, <laughs> you know? But it's not their fault or her fault that there's no water. It's going on, I think, four or five days now that the city can't seem to fix a leak. But I don't know the deal. You would think you'd be able to fix anything in that amount of time. But anyway, let's go back down. I think they're eating dinner downstairs. I'm grumpy <laughs> today. Tomorrow's going to be an awesome day. I know well, it's going to be a lot better than today. It's definitely getting a lot busier out there right now. 7.30, Thursday evening. Glad to, glad to see it. We're gonna walk down here. I'm feeling a little bit better. Uh, gonna walk down here and go to a foreigner grocery store that we saw. Maybe get some stuff for a uh, Maybe see if I can get some stuff for my mom. She, I bought her some ragu spaghetti sauce. I know that's kind of like, yeah, so what? But that's her favorite. And they don't sell it really in Thailand, except I found it at Villa Market. But, uh, let's see if I can surprise her with some more from here. Cougar. <laughs> I almost thought I was going to have to go there. A minute ago? Yeah. Hello, uh, hello, good rest. Yeah, look at the hair. Laundry road. She's, uh, this is the RCA district. Let's go check it out and see what's in here. There you go. That's the devil. Yeah, that's, those are for the devil. So far, nothing really interesting. Same mo, same mo.
definitely not going to buy that. <laughs> uh, I don't make the same mistake twice. Yeah, this is just like a regular store. Mom's never tried this though. She ought to give it a try. I don't know why they have tuna fish in there. That's weird. Not with the bacon, but maybe that. She might like it. Yeah, nothing really special in there. All right, guys, join us tomorrow. We are headed to a place we've never been in Surat Thani, just south of the town. It's on a beach, huh? Yeah. Looks like a beautiful beach. Surat Thani, like I said many times, is one of my one of my top picks of places that I would stay long term. Beautiful ocean, nice city, very Thai style, great markets, not too many tourists, but in an area where you can easily hop on a boat, head to Vault Pangan, as long as there's no full moon, or head to Got uh, Samui. But we, uh, we'll be doing that. We'll be doing a Southern Island tour here this year, which will include uh, all the islands down that way. But come with us tomorrow to Surat Thani. I'm sure I'll be feeling better tomorrow, and we'll all just have a great day. Get out of this place. Oh, the news said that, uh, what's today? 16. That the water pipe will be fixed on the 18th. <laughs> I'm glad we don't live here because that's like how long it, it took them seven days. And they're not done yet to fix a water leak. So I'm kind of wondering what kind of major catastrophe could that possibly be to take so long to get people water to their, to their homes and businesses. But Anyway, I don't know. <laughs> we'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm sorry for being cranky, but uh, yeah, I have food poisoning. Oh, on, a, on another note, the people upstairs making dragging the table around all night long, <laughs> it's not the people upstairs. It's actually the restaurant below us. It's echoing up the hallway. It sounded like it was there, but it's not. It's right there, so they'll stop um, soon, I guess. Anyway, mm -hmm. good night. Good night.